An update for you tonight on a story we first brought you last weekend and followed throughout the week. Iraq veteran Troy Yoakum has now made it to San Marcos in his trek across the country. He's raising money and awareness about veterans in need. Last Sunday, we profiled his determination in the face of obstacles like his dog nearly dying, his wife getting sick. Well, now he's got another problem, an infection in his foot that will sideline him for one week. But as KXN's Jacqueline Inglay shows us, today, Yoakum walked through the pain. Troy Yoakum is grimacing in pain with each step he takes. Yoakum is walking across the country to raise awareness and funds for struggling military families. But now, the Iraq war veteran is fighting an infection in his foot. I got really infected, and so the infection's kind of taken over my foot. It's not really allowing me to walk very fast or very far. It hasn't stopped him. Saturday afternoon, he limped into San Marcos. That's where he met up with city council member Jude Prather. Prather served alongside Yoakum in Operation Iraqi Freedom. Last time I saw Troy, we were in a tent in Kuwait, and uh, so it's, it's unique to get to run, him, run into him again in this capacity. Yoakum wants to raise $5 million for struggling military families. Over the past nine months of walking, he's raised $125,000. The problem's bad enough where not a day goes by that somebody does not contact me who needs some, some type of financial help. Prather is not surprised at his friend's perseverance or out there idea. When we were in Kuwait, Yoakum did a 36-hour drum solo trying to break the world record. The world record at the time was like 115 hours. Yoakum was beating on his drum when we caught up with him in Fredericksburg. He carried a mini version in San Marcos. I just got to keep telling myself to keep going, put one foot in front of the other, and eventually I'll make it to the end. Yoakum still has 3,000 miles left on this journey that started in Louisville, Kentucky, then went all the way to the Pacific Coast with a last stop scheduled for Boston, Massachusetts. Dave? The story you can get.